Hey guys, it's Ava from a and Plays. Today I'm going to be showing you how to make these five banners in Minecraft. Before we get started, please make sure to subscribe to our channel and click that bell so that you get notified every time we post. Also make sure to like this video and we'll go ahead and get into it. So these are the five banners we'll be making today. And to make those, you'll need a loom and then all of the items in here um, but I'll walk you through those once we get there. You'll also need, I just put these in my chest, so you'll also need to put all the banner patterns into your chest in your inventory. So all you have to do is search up banner, and then all these banner patterns will come up, and you'll need to put all of those in your chest in your inventory. Okay, so the first banner we'll be making is this ice cream banner, and for that you will need a light blue banner, orange dye, light blue dye, and white dye. Now we're going to go into the loom and I'm going to place the light blue banner in the first slot along with the orange dye in the second slot. Then I'm going to click on this design right here so that it creates a diamond. I'm going to take that banner and put it in the first slot. And now I'm going to take my white die and put it in the second slot. And then I'm going to tap on this one right here so that it creates a line in the middle. And I'm just going to switch that one out and take my light blue die and put it in the second slot and click on this one right here so that it forms this. I'm going to trade it out and put that one there and the white die here. And then I'm going to click on this one so that it creates a circle in the middle. The last step is to create or is to put the light blue die in the second slot and click on this design right here so that it creates your ice cream. So that is the first banner. That's what it looks like. And now you have an ice cream banner. The second banner we'll make is the sunset banner with the mountain. So for that, you will need a blue banner, white dye, orange dye, yellow dye, and brown dye. Go into your loom and place your blue banner in the first slot and your orange dye in the second. Then you're going to click on this design so that it creates an ombre from the bottom up. Then take that banner and put it there and then take your yellow dye and put it there. Now tap on the flower design right here, and then on the circle right here. Now take that banner and exchange it for your white dye, and then click on this one so that it creates a triangle. And the last step is to take the brown dye and tap on this one right here and there you go that is the second banner that one's probably my favorite out of all of them i think that one looks really cool and so that is how you make that one the next banner we'll make is the emoji banner and for that, you will need a white banner, white dye, red dye, yellow dye, and a black and a pink dye. <clears throat> so now I'm going to open up my loom. 
and put in my white banner and then I'm going to put my black dye in and tap on this design right here. Now I'm going to take that banner and I'm going to put in the white dye and tap on this design right here. Now exchange the banners and I'm going to put yellow dye in and I'm going to tap on the cross design right here. Now I'm going to put in the red dye along with this design right here. And then I'm going to use the pink dye and tap on this one. And then the last step is to put the yellow dye back in and tap on the border design. And now you have your emoji. So that is the third banner. This one's super cute and funny. So there is the emoji banner. The next one is the octopus or the squid. And for that, you will need one second. You'll need a purple dye. I mean, a purple banner. Sorry, white dye and purple dye. And you also need cyan dye. So I'm going to open my loom and I'm going to put in my purple banner right there. And then I'm going to put in my cyan dye and I'm going to click on this triangle right here. Next, I'm going to exchange my cyan dye for my purple dye. Oops. Okay. And I'm going to tap on this design right here. I'll put that one in. And I'm going to take my white dye and tap on this one so that it creates a line in the middle. And then I'm going to take my purple dye, sorry, I meant the cyan dye. So take cyan dye and click on this one right here, the border indented. Put that there. And then take the purple dye and tap on the circle so that it creates a circle in the middle. And you can actually leave your banner like this if you want, but I like to do one more step and take the cyan dye and put a border around it. And now you have your octopus banner. So that is the fourth banner. That's the octopus one. And then the last one we will make is the um, cactus. I actually forgot to put the stuff that I needed for the cactus banner in this chest, so I'm just going to have to get that real quick. Okay, so I have all my stuff that I need now. And for the cactus banner, you'll need a lime banner, lime dye, green dye, white dye, and pink dye. So open up the loom and put in the lime banner and then the lime dye also. And click on the field mason, which looks like bricks. And then take your green dye and put it in and you're just going to leave it on that same design so that it creates bricks again. Okay, so now I'm going to, oh, it just deleted my banner, oops. Okay, so I'm just going to do that again. So it's just the bricks, 
and then also the green dye. So hold on. Okay, sorry about that. So there we go. And then I'm just going to click on this brick pattern again. Okay, so I'm going to take that banner and I'm going to take my lime dye. And I'm going to click on this design right here. Now I'm going to take the white dye and click on the border indented right here. Next is the pink dye and that will be this one right here. Sorry, that one. It's a small one. So that one. And then the last step is to take the white dye and do the border. So this one right here. And now you have a cactus banner. So that is all the banners I'll be making today. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to comment down below if you would like a part two. And I will certainly film that for you. I hope you enjoyed and I hope this helped you. Um, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.